I just pressed record. Hi, it's Miranda. It's Miranda. So I'm gonna try not to go off in too many tangents, but I I can't I can't prom you I can't promise anything. It's me. Hi, it's me. I thought since we're we were getting close to the end of the year, it might be a nice idea to show some products that I've learned to like. This is just something I happened to do over the year with things that I bought when they were on sale and whatever in my local drugstore and supermarket. Because I'm me and I don't I don't have it like that, okay? So over the years I have learned that no matter what regimen I have tried on my face, the only thing that seems to work, and I know someone's gonna hate it and I've probably said it before in a video, is Dove Soap. Regular white bar. My skin looks the best when I'm using it. What can I tell you? I've tried so many things and it just... My face doesn't like it. So... I have one other thing and it's shampoos. I bought this one day because it was on sale and I wanted a new shampoo that made my hair feel better than it had been feeling because I'm trying to grow it out. I found this, again not sponsored by anyone. It is the Moisture Push Dream Curls, you know, L'Oreal. And I don't put product, I haven't put product on my hair in a really long time besides just washing it and that's it. I don't even put conditioner, I probably should, but I don't have any. I should have bought some. Maybe I'll do that next time. I use, I use up my conditioner more for shaving my legs. It's just what I do. I don't have any right now. So this on its own, you know, you could still use conditioner, but I noticed that it makes my hair just feel the shiniest and softest and not too soft to where it's like really thin. It just feels good. That's this one. So what happened was I bought this and then um, the next time I had gone out to look for it when it ran out, it was a sale. And I guess I had forgotten the exact description because I got Dream Lengths Restoring Shampoo. And since it was a two for sale, I just got this one too because I was like, maybe I'll like this the most. And it was rebalancing shampoo and it has three refined clays. Isn't that great? So I got these, and I tried them both, and they're okay, but for some reason I didn't like them as much, and I was like, maybe it's just a fluke, because you know when you first change shampoos, sometimes your hair just feels really good for a little while, and then it doesn't anymore. That one just kept making my hair feel good, so that's why I wanted to buy it. These were just okay. I was looking for that same feeling in my hair, so I reused some old shampoos I had around. So if you wanted to know this Garnier Fructis, I've been doing this thing this entire week where I have been taking a nice long shower and then like wearing an actual dress with my pants because I like my dress pants, uh, putting makeup on, just actually, you know, just trying to look like a semblance of somebody who attempted to look the way I do. I don't know. Um, today I'm even wearing jewelry. I'm not really a fan these days. It's, more annoying than anything for me it's just like i just want to take it off now but i had it it's on i've got my, my rings i'm avoiding this one <laughs> but you know a little cup so i tried this over the course of the week and i did not like the way my hair felt when i used it again i realized and i thought you know maybe it's because i've been washing my hair every day and i don't typically do that but I have been this week. And I was like, maybe it's because I've been washing my hair every week that it just my hair just feels really dry with that. But then I used this one today and it suddenly didn't feel dry, so. Take that for what you will. I can't really remember the other two. If you wanna know like actual descriptions of how my hair really felt when I used them, I don't really, I wasn't intending to make this specific video with like, oh, let me tell you, I have this chart. It's just something I thought of now that I was like, yeah, you know what? I, I wasn't really doing an experiment this week when I was taking a shower every day and dressing up every day, every day and doing my makeup every day because that's not typical for me. Um, I, I wasn't trying to do an experiment, but I guess I kind of did one. Yeah, it's been nice. I'll, I'll, still, I'll still wear dresses. I love dresses. The only reason it's frustrating to wear dresses now because it's cold. These are sundresses. You gotta put pants underneath. Sometimes a, a tank top. And after, it's just like, that's a lot of layers, but you need them because these satin. It's like satiny 
polyester, possibly nylon, I don't know, but it just feels satiny. So underneath, you need the leggings. I do. Even this is a little on the thin side, I gotta say. I should be wearing something maybe thicker. But around the house sometimes, I just put that big old robe on anyway. You know what one I'm talking about. Yes, the gray plaid, yes, that one, yeah. I think it's time for me to go now. See you later. to show the outfit. Okay. Bye. That's it. Oh, not that's it. <laughs>